don't be scared of the change. Scared to be the new kid. What's up, my fellow life forms? It's your girl Lily Jane here, back with another red reaction. Today, guys, we are getting into his track Sick Boy, and I'm not gonna lie, y'all, I'm turning into a major Ren fan. I was re-listening to his song Hi Ren recently, and I showed it to my husband, and he was just blown away with how unique his style is. And I think that's what's so fascinating about him. I feel like Ren has a lot of life experiences that he ties into his music, but the way that he presents them is a way that is never done before. So I'm really excited to see what Sick Boy has in store for me. Let's go ahead and check it out, y'all. Hi, Ren. Thank you for coming in today. Thanks for seeing me. Looking at your file here, it seems there's a very apparent interplay with your emotional state and your physical body. Have you ever heard of the trauma response? I don't think so. Basically, our bodies can get stuck in a negative feedback loop. Our subconscious can repeat patterns from the past, which can have a pretty drastic downstream effect on our biology. Essentially, your mind is making For that fix boy, anabolic steroids, them so post a boy, pass out. White noise, quick fix, snake oil. I'm about to break boy. Oh, what a shame, he's in pain. Have another go. Take another pill. Here, take a couple more. Let's see how you're doing in another week or so. You'll be feeling worse when the side effects will show. Derealization. You know, that right there, where it says when the side effects will show. Have you ever watched, like, one of those pharmaceutical commercials that show up on TV? The amount of side effects that come along with taking something that just helps, like, maybe migraines, for example. They're like, yeah, you'll shit your asshole out, but at least your headaches went away. That's the thing that blows my mind about modern medicine. It's like, is it really that safe if there's that many cons to it? I don't know, man. Have another go. Take another pill. Here, take a couple more. Let's see how you're doing in another week or so. You'll be feeling worse when the side effects will show. Derealization, medical patient, losing patience with the process. Walking hand in hand with Satan, complications with the medication. Inflammation, dehydration, inhalation, aggravation, building up a toleration. Drown, soccer, drown, soccer, drown, soccer, drown. I've been feeling like I'm drowning with my feet upon the ground. I've been screaming, I've been shouting, but I never make a sound. I've been looking for a way out, but I always seem to drown. Okay, no, we need to talk about his flow and the speed of that little burst that he just did right there because after he talked about you know the pharmaceuticals kind of being demonizing to him he spouted it out kind of like one of those commercials do they try to say those side effects as quick as possible so your brain doesn't have time to really think about what they said and like dude that's cool how he made the lyrics come to life to represent something in the real world i've been shouting but i never make a sound i've been looking for a way out but i always seem to drown is this all making sense Ren? um yeah i think so good what I propose we do is we try to pinpoint the exact experiences from the past that are keeping you stuck. What can you tell me about your childhood? Uh, I can't really think. It's okay if nothing comes up right away. What I'd like you to do is take some deep breaths with me. In and out. In and out. Good. Now tell me the first thing that comes to your mind. I feel like it's not me. It's the world that's sick. We're given everything we need and we commoditize it. We consume, we destroy like we're parasitic. Science tells us that it's suicide and still we commit. I'm not sick. We are sick. We are standing on a cliff in the name of progress. We jump off the precipice. I'm not sick. I'm the virus. You're the virus, hypocrite. How can you sit there with a smile on and tell me that I'm sick? Sick boy, sick boy, looking for a fix boy. Push it down in public, quick pose for the pick boy. Record label me. Things that come on the fire, gift boy. Why are you so upset? Don't you wanna be a rich boy? Fuck no, industry is cutthroat. I've been doing bits by myself, swimming backstroke, walking on a tightrope, rapping with a slit throat. The way that we persist is like the ending of a bad joke. As the people of old, we're complacent to assailants and we do what we're told. Counterintelligence is sight to behold. Rape the earth of all resources and we bleed it for gold. And we bleed it for wealth. We bleed it for fame. But when you bleed it, can you tell me what the will remain and i'm bleeding myself i bleed in my brain while i'm bleeding i'm the reason because i'm doing the same holy man oh my goodness i just 
that was a lot to process, especially when she said, like, you know, tell me about your childhood. And it kind of, like, he veered off onto everything wrong in society. So that was kind of, like, a page turner for me because I thought he was actually going to go into a little bit more about himself. But there was probably a lot of things that I missed because it's my first time listening to it. And there was probably a lot of anecdotes about himself in that little verse. But that was just a hard pill to swallow, honestly. It's hard to thrive in a society where we're constantly reminded by the negativity. And, like... For example, I even myself have gotten a slight phobia of driving recently just because I've been on the internet too much and watched too many crash compilations, things like that. And it's like, and they seem harmless on the outside. You're just watching a few videos, but after a while, it kind of replays in your head over and over again. And I kind of think that's what Ren's saying here too. It's like, sometimes life can have good intentions, but they're masked with really bad things behind them. And this song, honestly, it's just a lot to process. You know what Ren's music, there's tons and tons of layers. It's like a freaking lasagna when it comes to me so I could sit here all day and pick it apart. All I do know is it was an incredible song. It had two tons of bars and the, the and the somatics in it and how crazy Ren acts. He could be an actor, honestly. I love this, guys, but let me know down in the comments what's your favorite Ren song. Let me know down below and thank you again for watching another one of my videos, guys. If you enjoyed this Ren reaction, check out another one of my Ren videos. They should be popping up any moment. Thank you again for watching, y'all, and have a great day, guys.